guys, it's Daniel here with 10X Dynamic Customs. And today we're gonna to be reviewing my 2023 F-150. I have had this truck for about two and a half months now. So, well, the first thing we'll talk about is this agate black paint color. And I actually get a lot of questions if this is uh, black or blue. It is black and I love the black but it does get very, very dirty. As I get closer, you can see, especially on the back, all the dirt spots. And I just washed this truck yesterday. All right, it is hard to keep clean. So to go along with the color, I love the new designs of the 23 and 22 F-150s. I think they are just very good looking vehicles. Now this one specifically has the 5.0 liter V8. And let me tell you that V8 has plenty of power. Uh, it's rated for 400 horsepower. And uh, my brother-in-law actually has a 2017 or 18 uh, Raptor with the 3.5 twin turbo. And he says that this truck is, has a better get up and go than his Raptor. I personally, I'm not so sure about that, but he says it does. He's driven the Raptor and he's driven this. I haven't driven this Raptor. Another thing about these Fords and really Ford uh, has always been like this. And that's gonna be these huge back seats. And I'm pretty sure that other than the Dodge Mega Cab, uh, Ford has the biggest pickup truck back seat. So I also want to show you on these 23 F-150s. Now this is just the XL, just the work truck. But even just the work truck on these 23 F-150s come with eight inch touchscreen radio, Apple CarPlay, Android Auto, as you can see right here. And even though this is just the XL work truck, this also comes with a sport mode, a off-road mode, uh, and a slippery mode. I think it all, it comes, it's got the, this one has the tow package, so it obviously has the uh, tow and haul mode. And I want to say it actually comes with a mud and ruts package, but don't quote me on that one. I'm not, I'm not sure about that one, but this, this truck is four wheel drive. And with this truck being the V8, uh, it does only get about 16 miles a gallon. So, and I'm about to uh, put a two and a half inch leveling kit and uh, bigger wheels and tires on it. And um, I'm a little disappointed in that because my last truck was a 2014 F-150 and it got 15 and a half miles a gallon with a three inch leveling kit and 34 inch tires. So the, the, the miles per gallon is a little disappointing, but I'll definitely give up some miles per gallon for that V8. I mentioned that this has the tow package on it and uh, I have hauled things with this. I use this truck for work. So uh, I have hauled some tanks and some equipment with it and it's done just fine. Uh, it drives smooth with the trailer behind it. And uh, that's one other thing. This truck compared to my 2014 F-150, it is almost like a car in, in the way it drives. It's, it's just so smooth. So, you know, normally trucks got a little bit of, of floatiness or, or a little bounciness, but this one has none, none whatsoever. It almost drives more like my Chevy Blazer than my old truck. Hope y'all enjoyed this review of my new truck. Uh, I hope it helped you out. I hope it made you want to go buy an F-150. So uh, if you enjoyed this video, if it did help you out, uh, please give us a like and a subscribe. And uh, even comment, uh, let, us, let me know what your favorite part is about the new F-150. And uh, I will catch you in the next video. See you.